Congratulations, Derek. You are the winner of Big Brother. Well, he's used his undercover skills learned as a local police officer to win big on season 16 of Big Brother. And since then, starred in the popular investigation discovery series, Is O.J. Innocent? Well, now our friend Derek Lavasser has a new book coming out, The Undercover Edge, Find Your Hidden Strengths, Learn to Adapt, and Build the Confidence to Win Life's Game. He's back in studio with us to tell us all about it. Welcome back. Thank you for having me. It's, it's surreal seeing that and where we are now and what has transpired since then, but yeah. it, it, it's what makes it all worth it, honestly, looking at what... I've kind of accomplished since then and, and, and not and taken advantage of the opportunities that have been put mm -hmm. in front of me. So I'm Your really life that. really has changed because yeah, of has. that opportunity. When you originally signed up for Big Brother, could you ever dream that this would happen? No, it wasn't the plan. The plan was to go in there, win the money, change my family's life and go back home and just continue doing what I was doing. I had no interest in books or television shows. It's mm -hmm. just kind of right place, right time. Honestly, I've been very, very fortunate. Well, we've been lucky to have you on to, to share in that excitement with you because mm -hmm. you have had so much happen. So tell us about that OJ series that you were in and then now how it almost developed into, into more, into this right, book. Right, right. Well, OJ was, uh, you know, it was a big success and it mm -hmm. actually led to a new project with Investigation Discovery. I can't announce it yet. That'll be out next week, but okay. we've been filming over the last five months. That's going to be out sometime this year. Mm -hmm. Extremely excited about it. If you liked OJ, wait till you see this show. Yeah, it's going to be it's going to be amazing. But yeah, the book was something that started about two years ago mm -hmm. and I had a lot of people ask me about, you know, how'd you win Big Brother? You know, what was your Big Brother strategy? Sure. And when I thought about it, I didn't have a Big Brother strategy. It was kind of an approach to life that I use every day. So mm -hmm. the undercover edge is an approach derived from my personal and professional experience as an undercover detective. Yeah. And what I've done is taken the main components of undercover work, which are observation, adaptation, and communication, and adapted them to work in any situation. So mm -hmm. whether it's at work or at home, the reader can use the same skills, techniques, and lessons that I learned while working undercover in their own lives. And the goal is to hopefully have the same type of success that I've been able to have using this approach to communicating and interacting with people. You're right, because you bring up three key things that you don't have to be a detective, right? No, no. To, to observe or to adapt to something. Right. And really great lessons in here. How long did it take to put this together? I know you said it started about two years ago, but when you actually put pen to paper, was it hard? Was it's an, it a it's an unbelievably hard experience. One of the hardest things I've ever had to do. I, I had my, I, you know, I got my master's degree, and I thought that was hard. Mm -hmm. This this was ten times harder because the people who are editing this book, um, I wrote it myself. So the people that are editing wow. this book, they don't care about your feelings. So when you write something <laughs> and you think it's great, they'll send it back to you and say, no, you need to articulate yourself more. So mm -hmm. it was a process, and I'm very hard on myself. So there. There were times where I would write a chapter and I had a theme that I wanted to keep through the book and if I felt like what I wrote didn't contribute to that theme or wouldn't help someone, yeah. I deleted the whole chapter. Wow. So when you're working under that scrutiny, it makes the process longer, but I can honestly say, I'm not just saying it for the show, mm -hmm. I am so proud of this book. Every chapter oh, has a point nice. to it. Every There's personal stories in there about adversities I've been through. Mm -hmm. I really do think there's something in there for everyone and I, and I hope that it helps some people because it definitely helped me. That's that's great. I, I'm excited to open it up too. Before we let you go, mm -hmm. you had the Big Brother, the OJ series, this great book. What's what's next for you? Um, I'm going to start a book tour. You know, that's part of the reason I'm here. Mm -hmm. um, I was going to do it January 9th, but I'm going to be traveling out of town to go for a national TV show to announce this. I'm extremely Ooh. excited about it, but I didn't want to shortchange Rhode Island because honestly, the Rhode Island people have been so good to me and supported mm -hmm. me in so many ways. So we pushed up the book tour signing to January 6th, which is, which is this Saturday. Awesome. Barnes & Noble, Smithfield, 2 to 4 p.m. I'll be there. So you can buy the book. Barnes & Noble already has the book ahead of uh, the release date, which is January 9th. Uh -huh. And if you can't make it there, you can go on Amazon.com, Barnes & Noble, Books yeah, A Million. Plenty of anywhere. ways to yeah, get but it. But hopefully, hopefully don't let the weather stop you. Yeah. Come out. I'm going to talk about the book and sign everyone's copies. Yeah, that's really nice. You have that added touch. You can really ask them whatever you want. Derek, yeah. congratulations. Thank you so much. Happy Thank New you guys Year. for having me. You guys have been a, a huge supporter of mine, and I really appreciate it. Well, we're happy to have you, and you can snag your copy of The Undercover Edge. It's available everywhere on Tuesday.